Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lanyel Kuzar, and I'm the owner of Yes Event Decor and More. So I just got a new shimmer wall from House of Party. She was nice enough to send me one box of her champagne satin shimmer walls. And then I went and purchased another box because I wanna make sure that I have a backdrop that's at least eight feet high and six feet wide. So in this video, I'm gonna be putting it together and I wanted to bring you guys along with me. And then I'm gonna try out putting a curtain behind the shimmer wall so that the sun doesn't shine right through it, okay? So I wanted to bring you guys along with me so you could see how that works out, all right? So let's get started. So here's my two boxes of my shimmer walls. What I'm gonna do first is open these boxes and go through all of the shimmer wall panels because I just wanna inspect them to make sure that nothing got damaged in the process of getting to my house, right? So what I always like to do is just open up everything and then make sure that the shimmer wall panels are not damaged and that it's not missing any of those little squares, okay? But first, let me show you the color. Look at this champagne color. Look at this color, guys. I love this. And I was super excited when House of Party told me that they had this shade of gold because I have clients all the time that ask me for a gold shimmer wall and I didn't have one in my inventory. And then also, I've been very reluctant to get a gold shimmer wall because a lot of the shimmer walls, the gold ones, it's like a yellow gold, right? And I wanted one that was like a champagne gold. So this is perfect. I'm super excited to set this up, all right? So let me go through everything in the box just to make sure everything looks good. guys so I just finished going through all of my panels and for the most part they look really good there was just a couple of panels where um, these squares had came off so when you get your box of shimmer walls they will give you extra of the gold squares hopefully you can see that so they'll give you extra squares and extra pins hopefully you can see that so you could just use that to replace anything that may have gotten damaged or come off, right? Now what I'm gonna do is start to create my shimmer wall, all right? So what I'm gonna do is attach each of these panels with the zip ties that they give you in the box, all right? I will warn you, if this is your first time putting together a shimmer wall, it's very tedious. It's extremely tedious. It takes some time and it takes a whole lot of patience. So if I were you, I would play some music. <laughs> play some music in the background so that it could take your mind off of having to put all of these zip ties together. And what I'm gonna do, just to let you guys know, um, I'm going to build this in a way where it's going to be easy to attach to my backdrop stand. So I'll let you know how many of these panels that I put in each row, okay?
right guys so here's the shimmer wall so far i finished putting together both boxes of those shimmer wall panels so this backdrop is about six feet wide and eight feet tall i always like for my backdrops to be at least eight feet tall okay now what i'm gonna do is add my finishing touches so we are about to take this backdrop up a notch <laughs> I am going to add some balloons and some palm spears and some flowers and pompous grass to this. But I just wanna give you guys a quick tip. Now, if you want, you could leave this shimmer wall like this, but I am going to put a curtain behind it. So let me show you the curtain. All right, so I have these gold sequin curtains here, and I'm sorry guys, they're no longer available. I know someone's gonna ask me where I got these from. I purchased these from e Mart like three years ago, so before COVID, and unfortunately, they're not available anymore. But you don't have to purchase these exact curtains. I'll be sure to put a link to some gold curtains that you could use in the description of this video, okay? I'm just using these because this is what I have available in my inventory, all right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these behind this shimmer wall, all right? And I'll be sure to zoom in so you could see exactly how I do that. 